אל תיגע בסחורה. אל תיגע בסחורה. אל תיגע בסחורה. אל תיגע Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to the Fab Talk Show. We're broadcasting today from Berlin, from the Convention of Education and Mobility, which is a nice opportunity to interview Lior Frenkel, who's a musician based in Berlin. Uh, welcome, Lior. Hello. Thank you. We're going to have a nice coverage um, of his music and history on the Fab Talk Show with myself, Fabrice Schomburg, broadcasting on Fab FM for Halas Radio, that's Holland Art Lab Audio Service. So, Lior, um, What's, well, what can we expect today from your history of music? Hmm, I don't know. Just to have fun? Well, the first, um, what you've just been listening to in the entrance was um, Do Not Touch the Merchandise. Yeah. But hopefully um, after this wonderful episode of Leo Fenkel, you would like to touch some of his mer- merchandise. And yes, again, welcome to uh, Berlin. And the next um, track is called Adventure in Space. Mm, yeah, this is a track from the first album of uh, Hot Fur, uh, which is called Hot Fur, Parvachama. And uh, as I, um, for the, inter- for the um, people out there, Leo Frenkel is actually an Israeli living in Berlin, and Hot Fur is, is an Israeli ensemble. Yeah, right. That's right. Okay, so enjoy this adventure in space by Hot Fur.
welcome back to the Fab Talk Show with myself, Fabrice Schomburg and Leon Frenkel. We're broadcasting from the Town Hall in Berlin. And we're sitting in the Convention of the Education and Mobility. Well, being here in the Town Hall of Berlin makes you think. How would you translate that into your music? Mm, uh, I don't think I will translate it to my music. It's just, uh, I don't know what's, what we are doing here. <laughs> And, and what would somebody know what, if he was in space, what is he doing there? So this adventure in space, how would you reckon mm. in comparison to, being, to living in Berlin? The adventure in space in comparison to living in Berlin. Well, um, for me, Israel is the land and every, every other place is space. And living uh, in... Uh, in I'm, I'm right now I'm living in space. Well, that's that's nice to know that so uh, we're actually I thought I was in the town hall in Berlin in the convention of education and mobility but in fact we're in space. Yeah. And the hot fur is not actually the the performances you do are not actually based on music but there's a performance there with a theater and a story. Yeah, it was a long period of uh, process but uh, we began with um Uh, some kind of a show with um, a play inside the, sh the show that we did every every show and um, later on it became just to crazy nonsense with including uh, throwing vegetables on stage and stuff like that and uh, yeah so the next uh, piece we're going to be listening is from one of those shows and this is called the letter V mm -hmm. out of <laughs>
V for victory. Is that the meaning in Hebrew as well? No. The letter, the letter, yeah, actually in, in, in English I call it the letter V, but in Hebrew it's the letter Vav, which is the sixth letter of the alphabet. And um, no, it has nothing to, nothing related to the victory. It's just a, just a letter with a may, maybe spiritual meaning, but not in this case. And um, what stories would there be in your performances? Could you tell us uh, one of the stories, for instance? Mm, yeah, for example, the first story was uh, a story about a, a boy who was interfering with our rehearsals in the kibbutz. And uh, then we, we taught him a lesson. That was the, the story. Well, that's interesting. Um, you just mentioned the kibbutz. We'll get back to that. But in fact, so according to my understanding, your performances had two layers. One layer was the musical layer, with the musical pieces which you would be able to listen to onto, onto the CD. And the second layer will be a story. Yeah, actually there was always a conflict between the, between the music, the serious music, and the funny, uh, not so serious um, shows. And, and that, was, uh, that, that was something that brought spices, spice to the, to the show. Okay, so next piece is street music number five. And this is a live performance? No, this is from the, the second city of Hot Fair. It's a home recording. So you mentioned you had a home recording. Would this recording be in the kibbutz that you mentioned? No, this recording was recorded. This disc was re recorded in uh, Tel Aviv, in a, in a, an apartment that we used to live. Me, my bass player Ben Handler, and uh, the guitar player Nadav Bachar, and another friend Tal Folkman, and we recorded everything there. In it was like a, the bass so uh, apartment. So I understood <laughs> that the sorry. The core of the hot fur is actually more of a community. Of, it's not just musicians, you have artists in there. Yeah, we have uh, a lot of people, uh, mathematici mathematicians, um, artists, um, physicists, all of them. And uh, how would you describe this community? 
It's a community of people who want to feel that life is more than what you see and what you feel. It's, uh I've noted a few um, notes here on my, um, for the interview, and it mentions that this community is called the, the MOP community, as in from mopping yeah, the floor. Yeah, the MOP community in, in Hebrew, Chavurat Smartut. And uh, yeah, it's a community of uh, very good people. Everyone has his, his, his own contribution to the society. But uh, the MOP within itself has, has a certain statement mentioning that. How would that fit in your community? The idea about, uh, behind the MOP is that uh, life is, j- and, and your life is like a MOP. And uh, don't get too serious because you, wa- w- you once were born and one day you will get back to the ground and remember who, who you're going to face. Okay, so that's uh, for you, all of you out there. Welcome back to the Fab Talk Show in Berlin. We're in the town hall in the Convention of Education and Mobility or in space somewhere. And I'm here with Lior Frankel, who's situated in Berlin. For more information, you can always visit his site, which is www.liorfrankel.com. We'll mention that later. And um, his first ensemble, which is called Hot Fur, mm-hmm. has two CDs and one live CD with pieces which are not featured in those CDs. Mm-hmm. Right. The last CD is uh, from our last performance in Tel Aviv. Um, would there be a piece you'd recommend from that CD to listen to? Mm, yeah. Um, I think a, a theme from Heretz or... Okay, from Hertz.
So in the year 2001, you came to Holland. That's right. Left Israel, left all the family in pursuit of music. Yeah, went to learn in the, to study in the conservatory in Den Haag in Holland, composition. And how did that turn out? Well, it turned out very good, but I didn't like the school and I didn't like studying composition. Were you encountered with new sorts of music that, has ins that inspired your direction? Um, yeah. A lot of a lot of new things and new ways. For example, uh, uh, there I introduced to different ways of electronically and electronic composition. So you acquainted more with the electronic music kind of world. Yeah. And then you came back to the Holy Land. Yeah. And let's see how that works out. Jesus, 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 Jesus. <laughs> Jesus, 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 Jesus,
Well, the first piece you've listened to was called Jesus. Uh, yeah, Jesus, Jesus. And that's from an ensemble which is called Fun World. Yeah, it's not an ensemble, it's just uh, electronic and different compositions I do without any structure or um, under any constitute or band or ensemble or something like that. There's three compositions. And the second page after that was a different uh, project, which is Pieces for Pieces, from the album Pieces for Pieces. Mm, that's right, that's an album I made, uh, uh, Pieces from Pieces, only electronic music, uh, mostly out of uh, radio uh, recordings and uh, electronic manipulations of the recording. So it's samples from the radio, randomly? or Yeah, randomly. Uh, not not everything. There are a couple of um, voice uh, pieces, and one piece called uh, the Twentieth Century, which is a lot of different music from the Twentieth Century, all meshed up together. Well, what I find interesting about this album, Pieces from Pieces, is that it's actually there is no band. It's just an album. Yeah, it's just an album. And after that, you came back to Israel. You made this wonderful project, and I bumped into you in your home in Ramat Gan. Mm -hmm. And we had, a, I can tell you, we had a lovely one-hour session where I was had the honor to work together one hour with Lior. I wrote a story and he wrote music for a theatre production we worked together, Weather Wars. Yeah. Which you can find more information about that uh, on Sketched Worlds, www.sketchedworlds.com. And we did a good performance in Holland. And one of the pieces uh, performed on that uh, theatre project is The Ceiling Leaking. The Ceiling is Leaking. The ceiling is leaking, and that's performed with a different ensemble that was based here in Berlin. Yeah, that's a small ensemble I formed when I came here to Berlin, uh, called the uh, Small Elephants, but this ensemble is no more. The ceiling is leaking by the Small Elephants.
Yes, that's a very nice um, aquatic piece. Mm -hmm. But um, from these uh, small elephants, there's something that you did not like in the direction of how that went. Yeah, in, at the time I, I, I just uh, I felt already that I need to do my own uh, uh, more serious uh, ensemble with my new ideas, with the electronic uh, triggers, the, what I'm doing now with the, with the new band. But in fact, um, well this new band is the Frenkel band. Yeah. Frenkel. But in fact, uh, if we go back to the small elephants, um, you were not happy with the, that direction of how that went, but you were the direction. So in fact, perhaps you were not happy with yourself. Yeah, perhaps. <laughs> well, it's always good to turn another page in your own direction. That's right. Yeah. We're going to be introduced now to the Frenkel band, which is your latest project. Sure. Together. Together. <laughs>
Well, I'm here together with Leo Frankel in Berlin, broadcasting live from the town hall. Your latest project is the Frankel Band. Yeah, the, the Frankel Band, yeah. And the next piece of that we actually could hear is Together. Yeah, this piece I uh, wrote actually in Switzerland, in Basel, when I was there uh, one week alone uh, in a room. And uh, I learned, uh, I was in an in a Indian music uh, workshop, and my, my it's how, how can I say it, my, my thought ab- about this ind- the Indian music and my, my uh, process in, in understanding what is, what is my place in Indian music uh, brought me to, reco- to, to ro- write this piece, which is, has any, which, which has nothing in common with the Indian music, <laughs> only with uh, my music and Jewish music. And, uh, so there's a Jewish connection with an Indian connection. Yeah. So what is actually the Frankel Band? The Frankel Band is a uh, is a jazz rock experimental group um, with a unique sound because we we connect the drums with um, triggers to a computer, and the drum uh, is playing most of the solos instead of a real instrument and um, yeah that's it well here we are ladies and gentlemen the Leo Frankel band a good introduction to this band meditative structures and that's the following piece
meditative structure. structure. Well, apparently it's meditative structures, and I said meditative tra- structures, and that's uh, different kinds of. But that's from the word of meditation, is it? Yeah. yeah. Meditational structures, perhaps. Yeah, it's like a, um, a musical structure that that is reminding a meditative state, a meditative state. So where do you have this, um, and I, where do you reckon this band will go, which is actually your band, what do you, what in the future? I plan to start performing more and more, and everywhere I can, in the world. That's bookings at uh, liorfrenkel.com. A booking order uh, or uh, info at frenkelband.com. So bookings at frenkelband.com. Okay, booking at <laughs> frenkelband.com. <laughs>
Thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen, for sharing this lovely moment here with Leo Franklin and myself in Berlin, the town hall, in the midst of the education convention of mobility and education. I've got no idea what this uh, convention is, but we just found a nice corner and sat down here in the street. It's quite cold outside. Yeah, actually, I think it's starting. Oh, it's starting, so we just came at the right moment. Well, we might as well stay a bit. Yeah, that's interesting. And uh, it's lovely broadcasting for the Holon Art Lab audio service, halas.am, broadcasting for fabfm.org, on my sh program fabtalk.org. We mentioned the sketchedworlds.com project and the leofrenkel.com, that's more information on Leo Frenkel, and of course, frenkelband.com. Have a nice week, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> I did not know.